Yo, hello everyone, and welcome back to a brand new video. Want to link your social media account to your GoDaddy website? In this video, we will guide you throughout the steps to connect to your social media profiles, making it easy for visitors to follow and engage with you. So, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you can have the full experience. So, guys, most of you I know that you want to have such things when you go to a certain website and you find in the bottom or anywhere within that website the social media account of that specific site. So in this video we are going to do the same thing but on your GoDaddy website. So in the bottom or anywhere in the page depending on where you want it to be located you can actually add your social media account so you can share them with the customers or your visitors so you make it easy for them to engage with you on your social media. Now how we can do that well obviously the first thing is we need to own a website on GoDaddy. To do so, we simply click on Websites on GoDaddy, click on Websites Builder, and you will be able to get one for free, as you can see right here. Of course, if you want to buy one directly, you can simply just go for one of these plans. Or simply, guys, if you have already a domain name with GoDaddy, you can also get a free website connected to that specific domain name. Now, let me show you how you can do that. Click on your name, click on my products, and then you will be able to be taken to this page where there is the dashboard of your products. After that, we need to go more in depth and click on our domains. So we need to go to the dashboard of our domains by clicking on manage. And there we go. So right after we did that, what we need to do now is pretty simple. Just go ahead and click on the left side menu and click on website and then click on edit website if you do have it like that or create free website in case you didn't have the same options now as you can see right here we have this website and it's pretty simple as you can see now this website as you can see after i went all the way down into the bottom of the page you will notice that there is this black thing which is basically the footer this it could be in many uh, colors depending on the templates the, or the theme that you have chosen for your website. So for me, I have it in black, and basically the footer is the bottom of the page. Now, right after you hover on it or you click on it, the right menu will change entirely. You will have a lot of options that can be adjusted within the footer, like the layout, the accent, the colors, and a lot of things, as you can see right here. So here, what I wanted to do is simply go all the way down, and as you can see, social accounts add or remove links to your pages so as you can see here I have all of these social accounts that I can add first of all turn this on so we can have them already in our photo as you can see all of these accounts have been added without any problems directly let's try to preview it and see what happens so click on preview and as you can see if I went all the way down let me just first of all let me just go back once um, I have to save the actual changes so click on publish um, very good at the URL let's save and publish yeah let's save it and publish it let's wait a bit and then changes has been saved as you saw now we simply have to wait and then I will preview it and see how these actual icons works so let's view sites and as you can see let's go all the way down and here are support supposed to be the actual icons the only problem now is it didn't really refresh everything so we can for example cookies remove them so I'm gonna do something like that done and refresh the page and sometimes it will work sometimes it will not but it depends really on us so let's try to open it incognito and yeah the same problem they are not showing but normally guys after a few seconds these icons should be working and visible for us now what the problem is once you show these icons are actually sh starting to show up in your website these icons are, are not actually going to be directing the client to your own website because it didn't change the links so how can the google go to for example understand and know the links to your social medias so you have to adjust each one of them manually to fit exactly your goals so here as you saw they are not really showing up because we didn't add the links already so let's click here and just get a Facebook page around the Facebook page so Facebook 
and let's go to a random Facebook page real quick let's go for example this one and I'm going to copy it and then what I'm gonna do is to simply paste it right here click on done and right after I did that the changes has been saved so let's refresh the page let's simply accept that alright so refresh again and normally it's supposed to be here the only problems as I said is the cookies the cookies have not been refreshed as they should um, we can try this profile let's open the website on it maybe it will show us the correct version of the website uh, yeah still there's problems with the cookies they are actually yeah they are installing right now so install app we need to install it we need to install some stuff but normally the cookies will actually help us a lot to show the actual icons right here so these are basically the simplest way to add the social media into your website but there is another way which are basically as you can see here there is this contact with us this contact with us let me check if it is visible for now or not so let me just see uh, no, it's not showing up right now, so let's try to make it visible for everyone. So let me just click here at section, and in the section area, I'm going to choose social links. Click on uh, social links, and I'm going to choose, uh, for example, this one, add again. And let's name it, for example, hello, social media. And I'm going to simply publish it and save it. Publish, save and publish and we simply have to wait a little bit it's not going to show up right now it still has to be taken a little bit of time so let's wait a bit yeah, yeah it is published now and yes uh, even if we did the changes it might not be added successfully uh, or here it is finally finally or and here it is as well so the cookies now has been updated in our browser so this is perfect so here after I click here it's simply gonna take us to the Facebook page where I have chosen or paste the link of the specific Facebook page so with that being said guys this is exactly how you can add social links it's not really limited to Facebook you can add Twitter you can add Instagram YouTube LinkedIn TikTok Pinterest Yelp Discord Twitch house and much more so these are the ways so you can add your own social social media links inside of your GoDaddy website it's pretty simple straightforward you simply have to follow my steps that I have shown you guys in this video step by step one by one and you will be able to copy me in a very very easy way so yeah guys that was it for today's video if you didn't understand anything make sure to just recap the first method or the second method i have shown you click on add section and add the social links so thank you guys a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial